Hello everyone, welcome back. I have been a little under the weather recently and that is the reason why I have been missing in action. So I also decided to take a little break as well. But guess what? I have noticed that my confidence level is increasing and I am not as intimidated behind the camera as I once was. So, I am planning a comeback. Yes, guys, I will be back in the kitchen very soon. I really missed sharing my recipes with you all and I think that I should be more productive. What do you think? Let me know in the comments down below. I have a few things that I am planning for you all coming up very soon. So stay tuned for that. But today, I am just sharing a quick and easy DIY slash upcycle decor pieces. So let's look at a couple of clips that I put together for you. Today I'm going to be bringing a quick uh, DIY and upcycle of uh, these two wall decor pieces that I've had for many, many, many years. Okay, and um, I was a bit undecided as, you know, spraying them, but I think I um, really, you know, would prefer a crisp white color and um if you can you know if you stay tuned i'll show you in the end you know how i style them okay guys uh it's very cold outside here i think it's about uh, 38 degrees right now so i'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible uh, so that i can get back in in the warm toast tea house so I will uh, turn the camera off now and um, I'm going to spray them because obviously I don't want my iPad you know to get paint on it as well okay so I will let you see the end product and this is the paint here the spray paint that I'm using okay all right so I'll see you in a little bit okay guys here they are I think they look really nice and crisp, really pretty, and um, yeah. Okay, so the next time you'll see them, they'll be all nice and dried, and uh, you'll see how you know I style them on my wall. Okay, see you in a little bit. So this is how I display my decor pieces on the wall in my dining room. I think it turned out really awesome. And I'm really loving, you know, the crisp white colors with the black and white ribbon. And you can use any embellishments of your choice. The possibilities are endless, guys. I was actually thinking of uh, putting some red ribbon on because of um, Valentine's that is coming up. But um, you can also use the spring colors, you know, the pretty ribbon for spring, those pastel pinks and blues and yellows. And even at Christmas time, you know, you can decorate them for Christmas as well. I am really happy and pleased with this little project. I hope you guys like it as well. And let me know what you think in the comments down below. So I would like to thank you guys again for watching and thanks for your patience. And today I'm going to be rolling up my sleeves and getting some work done. There are lots to do. So I hope you enjoy the remaining of your weekend. Be blessed. And I will see you again in my next video. Bye-bye.